Hi, my name is Ashish and uh, we are working on this AWS project wherein we are creating an Amazon VPC for use with the DB instance. DB instance would, would connect with the web server and the web server would be exposed to internet. So this is the step one wherein we will create a VPC with private and public subnets. So let me just quickly log on to the AWS console and take it from there. Okay, I'm logged on to the Amazon console and uh, in the top right corner you see Northern Virginia. I'm going to change it to US West Oregon. This is US West 2. I select it and the console will take me to the same screen but on the top I would see a different region which would be US West Oregon now. And now in the upper left corner you will choose the VPC dashboard. So here select VPC. Click on here. You will see a VPC dashboard and here you will see a launch VPC wizard option. Click on it. Now on the step one we will select a VPC configuration. We will choose VPC with public and private subnet. Here it is. You get a VPC with single subnet. You get VPC with public and private subnets and hardware VPN access. We'll, we'll go with the VPC with public and private subnets. And now the VPC in public private subnet, the IPv4 CIDR block would be 10.0.0.16. I am going with no IPv6 CIDR block. The VPC name is whatever you want to give. We can give tutorial-vpc. And the public subnets IPv4 CIDR. I would go with 10.0.0 slash 24. Availability zone would be US West 2A. Private subnet IPv4 CIDR would be 10.0.1.0.24 US West 2A. Private subnet name would be Tutorial Private 1. Tutorial public and here would be tutorial private one. You go here elastic IP allocation ID. use a NAT instance instead my instance NAT instance would be T2 small key pair I would go with no key pair I'm going to skip service endpoint field and uh, enable DNS hostname I'm going to go with uh, yes hardware tenancy I'm going to go with the default so you can click here on create VPC it is creating your VPC with private and public subnet we'll see it is running the NAT instance this may take a few minutes it will provision a, an EC2 instance at the backend and would integrate it with this uh, VPC. So let me just pause the video and come back. It's moving fast now, okay. Okay, my VPC is up. My VPC has been uh, configured. If I go with my VPCs. I have one P VPC which is a default one. You would click here. Default set to yes and the one that I have created the name tutorial VPC the default you would say the no. So the default is the first one. My VPC is not default. I have created it. 
ओके सो दैट इज हाउ यू क्रिएट अ वीपीसी विद पब्लिक एंड प्राइवेट सबनेट एंड इन द नेक्स्ट स्टेप इन स्टेप टू वी विल क्रिएट एडिशनल सबनेट्स इन दिस वीपीसी सो इफ यू हैव एनी क्वेरीज प्लीज मेंशन देम इन द कमेंट सेक्शन एंड आई विल सी यू गाइस इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो थैंक यू